Hello everybody, I'm well, uh, whoa, voice. Anyways, hello everybody, and welcome back to a new episode on the new save file. There you go, just about managed it, just about managed it. Anyways, we're gonna jump in again, um, and I don't know who we're gonna, who we're gonna play as. Let's, let's take a little look-see. Tainted Lazarus, we've got a lot to do as, but I just don't want to play as him. Um, Tainted Forgotten's fun. We can maybe do, like, Mother Tainted Forgotten. Let's give that a go. Uh, I do also have a another new mod on. Obviously, we still have this mod on. I'm not going to play Isaac Champions on every run. Um, but the other mod I have on is actually something that you can see right here that I did, that I did actually disable. But I'm going to just go through it really quick. So, we have a mod that has some tweaked starting trinkets. For some reason, my settings didn't save, um, on the, some of the characters. Tainted Forgotten is definitely one that I wanted to disable. So, if we can go through here, basically, there's just a mod that, that kind of tweaks the starting trinkets of some of the characters, and I actually think it's really cool. Um, some of them, it obviously just makes them stronger outright, um, but some of them, it makes them sort of more boring characters a little more interesting. Some of them, I do think, are a little stronger than they should be, but this is why you're able to enable and disable them. So, the ones that I think I disabled so far was Maggie, because she starts with Maggie's Faith, which I think is a bit strong. Um, what's one of the other ones? Kane, because he already gets the paper clip, and I don't really see why he should get Lucky Tur. I, I like Judas starting with Judas's tongue and your soul. That's a really cool idea. Um, where's the other one? So, let's go through. So, we've got Missing Page and Demon's Tale for Azazel. That's a cool idea. Lost Cork and Bible Tract for Lazarus is a really good one. Error 404 for Eden. Uh, the Lost starting with Faded Polaroid and Fragmented Card is one I'm going to turn off, just because I think the Lost is strong enough as it is. Um, Chad Leash and Blind Rage for Lilith is a great idea. Rib of Greed and Star Key for Keeper, really good. Um, Rosary Breed and Change Key for um, Apollyon really interesting. Apple of Sodom and, Fir um, and Burn Finger for Forgotten seems a bit strong in my mind, so I'll turn that one off. Obviously Bethany I'm turning off, because she starts with Filigree Feather. That's, that's one that I just can't. <laughs> the Twins of Broken Glasses for Jacob and Ease, that was a really good idea. Um, Dice Bag Tea and Drop Charm. There's some really cool ones. Just, just, just take a look as I'm going through here. Tainted Kane's another one good disable. Crystal Key's really strong. Um, Tainted Judas starting with the left hand's kind of interesting. Um, let's see what else we got here. Red Patch Lord M80. Number Magnet. Cancer and Endless Nameless is another one for Tainted Lazarus. I thought it was a bit strong. Um, Crack Crown and Dimble for Tainted Lost, very strong. I have been talking to the developer of this mod, by the way, about balance, and they have actually already done, like, a balancing pass, and I think they're gonna do a little more as they go. Um, but it's pretty cool, but yeah, um, t I think Tainted Bethany, um, uh, oh no, sorry, Tainted Jake was another one I wanted to turn off. But yeah, I don't think my settings actually saved, but I think if I restart now, I shouldn't have those trinkets. Yeah, there you go. I think this one is one where I I I'm not a big fan of starting with, um, with Cursed Skull. But there is some interesting ones in there, and I realise that some of you are um, probably more purists and don't want to see the vanilla characters tweaked in that way, but I just think it's going to add something a little more interesting and fun, and it's nothing its nothing crazy, it's not massive changes. I just think it's some like a little addition um, to some of the characters that's quite fun. Um, so I, I'm going to keep it around for now. Do you know what? Let's, um, let's bomb these. See if we get anything for it. Worth a try. Worth a try. I mean, we've got golden bombs at the minute, so let's... Uh, Let's go hell for leather and just destroy everything. Sadly, nothing there. Nugget bombs. While not amazing, nugget bombs aren't that bad. Um, in fact, ooh. <laughs> pretty, pretty lovely room for us there. Oh, I didn't realise... I didn't realise there was three spiders there. I was not prepared. I thought there was only two. Um, some pretty good stuff in the shop here. In fact, I am going to bomb this and try and uh, pick one of those up. All the bloody spiders. Fortunately, didn't get a lot of money from that, but we might be able to make up the five cent here or there. Because we've got this here, which is pretty good. And we've also got the golden card, which is also pretty interesting. Um, could provide us with some... Decent benefits. What's with all the fucking spiders? Come on now. I realise there's a chance that you get spiders, but it doesn't have to be a near guarantee, does it? Stop it with the spiders. 
Okay. Whoa. Um. Excuse me? That's the crack that lets you go into the void. What is that doing here? I'd very much like my boy back. Excuse me? You can jump on top of things now? Since when, you piece of sheet? Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what the crack from the void is doing here. But I'm not going to touch it because it'll take away my passive items. Stop spawning spiders. Fuck me. Just give it a rest. Give me some money. I'm not expecting a lot, but come on. There you go. One cent. Holy. I didn't. Yeah. God damn. Had a harder time on this floor than I would have expected. My nugget's doing well, but these guys are a little hard to hit. Got him. <gasps> ha ha! The only time Pageant Boy has ever been good, to be fair. That was a feckin' good ca- Oh my god. I mean, unfortunately that golden penny wasn't very good, but overall that was pretty damn spicy. Dude, the spiders. I might actually kill myself again with a spider. Right, go with this. Uh, spawn a random pickup on killing a champion. Pretty good. And then this here. Um, uses once two random tarot cards. Cannot use uh, certain cards. Or, uh, teleport cards will only be used rarely and cannot be drawn during boss fights. Pretty good. Pretty good. Right, this is a pretty fun start to a run. Um, of course, we're going to try and find secret room and that lot in a moment. And you watch this give me nothing as well. Oh, I fucking walked into the goddamn fire. Okay, I am really heavily shitting the bed when it comes to not taking damage so far. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, what you got in store for us here? A butler and nothing. Dude, the spiders. Ugh. It's, it's gross beyond belief. Okay. Keep it moving. Not been a great first floor, let's be honest. Not been a great first floor. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Like, it's, it's going to take my passive items, so I'm not going to touch it, but very confused as to why that appeared. We're not under a time limit here, so let's try and find second secret room if we can. Although, I'll be honest, I'm not all that confident on where the hell it could be. Um... Could it technically be here? Yes, I guess. Hey, it is. Nice. Okay, and we get something else we're not really that interested in. More spiders, potentially. Ooh, ooh, that's, that's unfortunate to get after the facts, you know? I just blew up, like, all of the goddamn rocks. I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do another pass and see if I can... See if there's any rooms I forgot about, but <laughs> that's a little unfortunate, definitely. Any rocks for me? Any rocks? Hello, hello. Dude, look, Lucky Rock used to be so good. They, they proper nerfed it into the ground, didn't they? I mean, it's still good, but goddamn, it used to be insane. <laughs> it used to be so goddamn crazy. How I long for those days right now. I'm still getting a good bit of money here. No rocks in here. No rocks in here. Okay, I think we're all good. Unfortunately, we uh, pre-bombed this room. But we got enough for another item. Should we come across a decent one next floor? So, I do not mind...
You know, good enough stuff. Right, down we go, down we go. Very, very good use of golden bombs on that floor. I have to say. Okay, I just got the lovers this time around. Lovers obviously not going to do too much for us, but we're going to get some cards here and there that are going to be real good for us. So I think this could be pretty good. And it's, it's, the thing is as well, it can use one to two tarot cards. So sometimes it's going to use more. I mean, imagine we get this with like car battery or um, what's the other one called? Um, electric dice. Like, dude. Ooh. Ooh, baby. It's going to be so, so damn good. Right. Let's pop in here real quick. Sorry, lads. You're all dead now. Um, so far, we've only got one key, so we are going to be a little careful about our key usage if we want to do Mother. That's our main goal right now, so I would like to um, try and make sure that we have a key available for that. But skipping our item room would also be sad, so let's just hope the game doesn't be a bitch. Let's hope we get given what we want. Hey, and this time we get golden key as well, so that solves that key issue that uh, I was just about to complain about. Check the secret room here. Beautiful. Stars. Okay, anyway, regardless, the key issue is solved. <laughs> Turn head's decent enough. Not bad. It also makes our character look goofy as heck, and I like it. Magus. Ooh, Magus is kind of interesting. The Tower and Wheel of Fortune. Nice, nice. The Empress and the Magician. Yeah, dude, I'm, I'm liking this uh, active. For being quality one, I've got to say it's pretty decent. For being quality one, I've got to say it's pretty decent. Right, what we got going on in here? Um, what do we get on this floor? We get two bombs plus two keys, and I'm not willing to carry this either. For seven cent, five bombs is pretty worthwhile, I've got to say. Uh, we could roll the machine to try and get a better trinket or something, but I'm kind of more on board with just keeping my money for now and seeing what we can get from it. But yeah, remote detonator at half price is, even at full price, it's, it's, it's three bombs cost for five bombs, which is pretty decent. Even if you don't take the item, but getting three bombs cost for one and a bit bomb. Now that's, that's a deal I can get behind. Nice. Nice easy kill. Devil deal, obviously we're not going to go for. Range is pretty nice considering we have the forgotten range burn fix as well on currently. Right. Down we go. Oh, What? He wasn't taking damage then, apparently. Right, down we go. We do have a curse. This floor, as we can see, by the little cloud that's appeared. Hey, we got the boiler. Nice. Okay. We are ready and raring to go. Big old pill. I don't think double addicted does anything, does it? I, I was going to say maybe it lasts more than one room, but I don't even think that's the case. Cool. Nice. And I'm probably going to take whatever the other thing is, because Mongo Baby doesn't... <sighs> Anima Soul is actually pretty decent, but um, I don't know. I'm really liking this card idea. Maybe I'll use this for the rest of the floor, see if we get any good payouts, and then maybe I'll stick with Anima Sola. Anima Soul is just so damn good. Fortunately, nothing from those. Good. I said, we'll try to use the card thing to the, the, the fullest of advantage that we can, which that's actually insane if we had red hearts, but we don't, so it's not. Also, this room is disgusting in ways I cannot describe. That, that room, that's, that's annoying. That's like... Nearly a guaranteed payout from that guy, <laughs> and we can't goddamn use him. 
Okay, that's not what I was expecting when I hit that. Right. I missed all of them on that? Oh my god. It seems that like my burn swing when I throw sometimes isn't doing damage, and I don't know why. Yeah. Back through this way. Golden bombs again, baby. Oh my. Oh my, oh my. Money is gonna be rolling in right now. Beautiful stuff. Hopefully we'll find a crawl space as well amidst this chaos. We'll see. Good fellas. Oh my god. Check what's going on in here. The devil disc. Oh! That was unexpected and beautiful. And what we got in here? Coupon dude. It's giving us some good stuff that I just don't want. <laughs> I really should want, but don't. Right, secret room, I'm not entirely sure, and I don't think it'd be either of these, but I'm gonna put the bombs there anyways. Probably down this way somewhere. Oh, you... Bugger, stop. Yeah, money is just, yeah, insane right now. Uh, second secret room could maybe be here. Worth checking, I guess? Nah, it's not. Okay, where's, where's normal secret room? Is it attached to this? Sometimes the L-shaped rooms harbor a secret in their, in their cranny, in the nook. Good old mushrooms. There's three pills in here, I'll take them. Speed down I don't like. I can see forever is fine. Hematemesis is whatever. Dude, if, if only we had red hearts right now. Yeah, a little annoyed by the speed down, but what you gonna do? Right, where the hell is second secret room? All will be revealed to us as we walk up to it, so... Where could it be? Where could it be? It's probably off of the, de the devil room, isn't it? Let's do the boss now. Let's check. Not off here. Okay, this isn't the boss that it said it was at all. Ah, you bastard. I didn't even mean to draw that circle, it just kind of worked out that way. It was pretty nice. Good old bit of Jesus juice. And we'll go with Pride Pin here. The Emperor, okay. Guess I don't want to fight the Angel then. Right, let me just quickly go see if I can find that second secret room. Ooh, 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 quick, 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 quick. We got Dark Bum real quick, we got Dark Bum. Get in there, my boy, get in there. My guy, my guy, quick, quick, quick. Grab it all, grab it all. Yeah, boy, we got a black out of him. Keep giving me fucking cards. But still, that was pretty clutch. Free trial. Managed to fit in as much value as I possibly could there. Right, okay. We are going to the mirror realm. Oh wait, we're already a ghost. Doesn't matter. I forgot about that. 
Anyhow, to the Mirror Realm. Now, remember, we still have Golden Bombs. I'm still going to be bombing the ever-living heck out of everything. Okay. Bomb all of it. Might get an item or something at some point, so we gotta keep trying. Yeah, no, stop you. I'm not gonna let you do that. We need to blow up these blue fires as well, potential soul hearts, keep our health nice and healthy. Hey, oh, look at that. Beautiful. Ah, oh, bugger's moving on me. And more bombs as well, beautiful. For the next floor. Indeed. Right, good, good, we got that. I don't, I don't know if we could do another boss fight, to be honest. I'm just not confident enough with a boss that I don't know all that well. Like, I'd love to, but yeah, I just don't know the boss that well. The Empress. Right, crack these open. Now, we get pretty good value so far out of uh, good old golden bombs. Pretty lucky with them, to be honest. Cool. Yeah, okay, I think we're gonna leave it there. Fortunately, so. Pop on back through here. And we'll also bomb it as well for uh, the increased um, reflected item chance. I think that's worthwhile. And we'll be leaving this floor with quite a lot of stuff. Uh, I'm just gonna quickly buy the, um, the low cost card in here and see what it is Pot of Greed. Draw two cards. Lovers, Temperance. Dude, this game is really like, hey, if you had a red heart container, this would be the best floor ever for you. Damn shyster. We just about have enough bombs to get through this door. <laughs> okay. Right. Last few bombings. Let's see if we can air out a little bit more value. I mean, we've got 70, 76 coins. I really don't think we need any more, but... If you can take more, why not? And I forgot to grab Anima Solar, so I guess we're sticking with this card-based item, aren't we? Oops. Ooh, random smelted trinket. Energy Searcher. I don't remember what Energy Searcher does. I don't think it's bad though. I think it's something to do with card drops. Okay. None of them are spiders, at least. Good. A little careful around these boys. Fool card. I don't know my strength card went. I think I left it in the secret room. Oopsie. In the secret room? You know what I meant. Cash room. Give me that bad boy. Ah, oh, yeah. Fucker, I walked right into that one, literally. Okay. Nice turning those guys into poop. But yeah, I'm hoping this, this, this card thing ends up paying for itself. I mean, more bombs. Filling gaps is, is legitimately pointless for us because we have flight, but thank you nonetheless. This looks secret roomy to me. That it was. And we get alpha coin. Oh, dude, I turned that guy into a poop so he didn't drop a soul heart. That's not fair. Alpha coin. Um, I'll try out alpha coin for a little bit.
Cool. Activates a random energy card. Dragon energy. Dragon energy. I don't know what dragon energy does. Ah! Ah! I've been an idiota. It's okay. We, oh, we've got an XL floor. I'm rather on an XL floor here. Okay, we've got a lot of dudes throwing a lot of stuff at us. Not quite sure where that Necronomicon effect came from. Do we have a black heart? Why did he hold up the book? Does he normally hold up the book with a black heart? I don't remember that. Oh, you big shit house! Oh, you did it again, you fuck! Okay, okay, okay. Can we stop taking just the most damage possible, please? We have lost a lot of HP. Oh my goodness, I am. Oh no, walked into a fire. Okay, this is. I don't, I don't want to talk about it. I do not want to talk about it. That might be the most damage I've ever taken in a non-endgame boss fight. That legitimately might be. I think, I think I lost like six hearts there. That was, that was a fucking bismal. Let's stick with this. This thing's better. That was absolutely abysmal. Do you know what it is? My damage is just dog shit. <laughs> I keep expecting enemies to die and they're just not dying. Like, I've got 6.64 damage, but it just, like, it doesn't feel like anywhere near enough for this character. Also, I've got this thing where killing champions gives me stuff, and the game is just like, well, no champions for you. I actually can't believe how much health I lost. <laughs> not not even the worst part of it. The worst part of it is I still have to pay two hearts to get the fuck out of this floor. Oh, thank you. That was so necessary, it's unbelievable. Oh my god. This has been a real trial by fire. Quite literally with this floor. Stop it, you. No one cares for your antics. More of those dudes. My goodness, I got hit again, baby. Right, I think we should pay this guy out until he gives us an item. Do you know? A HP up, maybe? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Feel like that was pretty necessary for the uh, circumstances of, that I've put myself in. That wasn't a soul heart, that was a boy. <gasps> An eternal heart? Okay. Game's making it up to me a little bit now. I'm right, what we got going on in here? Mum's contact, good enough. Good enough. Right, this, better, what, this next one better be insane. I'm looking for just the creme de la creme of items. Fucking bastard of a shit piece of crap. If I don't get magic mush out of this room, I will cry. How dare you, game. I had a one simple wish. I had a simple, simple wish. And you have 
completely killed it. Anyhow. Anyhow. Let's, uh, let's try to do our other boss fight here. Oh, you fucker. Plus 10 bombs. I mean, that's something. Okay. Don't even know why I took this, because I'm not going to need the money. <sighs> right. This has been a stressful floor. I'd be on full HP right now if I hadn't have uh, if I hadn't messed that up the way that I did. Is that a spin down shard I see? Oh, hell yes. Oh, hell yes. Spin down shard. Take me away. Show me that beautiful paradise. Oh, I just fucking launched myself into the temperance machine by accident. Oops. Okay, at this point I'm going to take the rib of greed just in case we get a thingy shop. I've got so much money. Big pill. It just dropped my item. Drop your current held active. Oh, okay. An interesting idea. Right, we got ourselves good old flesh kid. The, uh, familiar that chase enemies to contact damage has three stages, collect red hearts to evolve. Okay, yeah, we'll just take that boy. If we can, there you go. Also, I don't know what trinket we've got here. When uh, entering a room, one random enemy will be crippled. Nah, I'm gonna stick with what I got. Right, flesh kid, it's your time to shine. There's potentially so many red hearts for you to gobble. Gobble on, my good child. Gobble on. Oh wait, we can we can use the bed for soul hearts, right? I forgot about that. Right. Good stuff. Okay, health is looking healthy. Dude, grab the heart. Thank you. He does not want that red hair. Excuse me, assassin. Where did you come from? You cheeky fucker. <sighs> sack altar? Really? You want me to use sack altar on this boy? Right. Hold, hold off. Hold off. I'm going to look for a reroll. I've got that suppository so I could take Sack Altar into a secret room and re-roll it. But the chances of me getting a, a re-roll on this floor aren't super high, so... I'm not going to be super hopeful for this plan to work, but... There is a plan there. There's currently a plan sitting in my mind space. Ow. Ow. Nice. Secret room. Secret room. We've got so many bombs that we just don't have to care.
Don't need the money. Mustard seed. Good stuff, especially on this floor. Devil disc. Nice. King baby, I guess. King baby. Yeah? Why not? Right, leave them guys to scoot off. And in here we got, we got the quarter. Not that we goddamn need it, but we got the quarter. Thanks. That's a lot of sacrificial blood. Okay. Got him. Okay, first of all, spin down into here first. Oh, dude, the game is being such a bitch. <laughs> Just giving me so many active items and items I can't use. That's not even the right key piece. Fuck you, game. Okay, so this is a this is this room's a bust. The magician. Big sad. GMO corn I'll take for the damage. Got tears down out of that. Lovely. Pfft. Don't even know what to say. This floor's been a bit gross. I want to see my Ultra Flesh Kid get super strong, but honestly, Sackholder is looking very, very appealing right now. Okay, we got we we got to keep our Flesh Kid. Okay, that worked out reasonably well. I don't know what the second thing it took was, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna worry about it. Health is back up to a, a very good level. Going down to the next floor. No curse this floor either, which is very nice to see. We'll hope that spin down is a bit more useful this floor. I forgot Flesh Kid. Let him eat. Let him eat. Let the boy have his lunch. Give him all the food he needs to grow big and strong. It said it needs 15 hearts. Is that 15 half hearts or 15 full hearts? Fool. Um, we don't have any reroll method right now, so Fool doesn't really do much for us. Damage all enemies. Transite a pedestal into three. Let me get him wisps. Eh, don't need that right now. I can see forever is kind of useful. Compass. Unfortunately, we've not really had a lot to spend our wild fortune on. Game speed are not very generous in that regard. Right, just keep moving. Nice. Still don't know what these big guys in the sky do, because they never seem to actually drop. Come here, lump. Oh, come on, give me more red hearts. I know normally I don't want them, but right now, they'd, they'd, sit, they'd sit quite nicely with me.
I'm not quite sure what's going on here. Okay. I thought I saw a red button when we spawned into this room. My first reflected thing. Turn some people into poops. Got down the bombs. Okay. Piggy bang, come on now. Baby Pluto, I can I can get with some baby Pluto, I'll be honest. That's pretty lovely. Especially considering it attaches to this guy. I think these saw blade guys might be my least favorite enemy. Saw blades are really fucky. Probably not a good room to do this in, to be honest. Let's uh, find a new room. Fair. So far, nothing really great. Tears up there. What makes you large is kind of decent for us. Still nothing to use spin down on the mantle beads there to chill out. Nice. Okay. Great. Great one to get there. High Priestess in the mum fight. Perfect card. Nice. Good. And come in here and grab this. Okay. Using our boy to block most of the shots here makes this a lot easier. We still don't have a ton of damage, to be honest. Fried pin's kind of keeping us grounded with damage when it gives us a good effect. Flesh Kid has evolved. He has become sentient. I mean, he was already kind of sentient. He has become full-bodied, like a wine. He has aged like a fine wine. Okay, where, where are we going? Where are we going? Just straight to the boss? I'm guessing this isn't the way straight to the boss. It never is, is it? We've got to get him to max level before the actual boss. Just got to. I want to see him come to fruition. Grow up. Dude, the golden bombs this run. If you haven't got golden bombs unlocked yet, do yourself a favor and go do it like right now. Because they're goddamn so good and they show up often. At least for me, they do. I will take small rock. Thank you. Every enemy with confusion, I think I'm okay, thanks. More tears, that's good stuff. And here, a whole heap load of nothing. I get my spin down back. Still, still yet to be able to actually use that spin down. I, by the way, I've got to say, I love like the idea of glass spin downs. It's such, like, spin down is such a fun mechanic and you so rarely get to actually utilize it. It's so fun to have like a way on runs where you don't actually have to spin down dice to get like a spin down because it could be so good. Like obviously some some runs it's going to be meh or like not very useful, but it, it just has the potential to potentially be so amazing. Eat up my child. Very, very bad hit by me there. I just kind of walked into that guy. Eat up my child. Yum, yum, yum. Eat up, my child. Go, go, go. Now this makes everything okay again. Now we have our health back. And it's in black heart form too, which... Very nice. 
Fuck yeah. Boss, we see you. Okay, I'm not quite sure what these sucky boys are doing, but... Again, don't want much to do with it. Eat up, eat up. Yum, yum, yum. You're almost there. Okay, y'all, y'all are, are all attacking yourselves. It's, it's working out for us, I think. Honestly, betrayal is such a better item now that they changed it to like be in fighting. You don't really think about it. It's one of those items that kind of passively does its job, but does it well. Mr. Dead, gotta love Mr. Dead. Good stuff. Got ourselves something pretty nice here. I like it. I like it. And then in here, we get the soul, which is pretty good. I don't know what this is going to spin down into. I have legitimately no idea what that other thing is, so I'm going to try it. Because I've got such little chances left. Heart, heart broker. Two broken hearts. Broken hearts can now be used to buy devil deals if you have any. That's kind of interesting. I mean, I'm not going to take it because it's unnecessary, but I like the idea. Ow, that was a spicy key. I didn't realize. My bad. Okay, to the next floor. Yeah, um, definitely not the best use of our spin down, but it was an experimental spin down usage. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Now there's a bunch of books. I was like, nah, there won't be any items on this floor, or there'll be very few at least. I can just use it here. I see you, game. I see your trickery. You give me a bunch of books that could have been spun down into all sorts, all manner of beautiful things. Come on, we need to get Flesh Kid grown up before the boss fight. We have to. It's our duty. Oh my lord. Oh, my stars. Oh, this would have been such a good room for it as well. <laughs> we could have got so many passive items. Fuck. At least take Bookworm. But yeah, that's, that's a real kick in the teeth right there. And that, kids, is why you don't waste spin down on something that you don't understand. Good lesson for anyone to learn. You get back in that wall, bitch. <laughs> My fleshy boy, you, you're, you're barely... You're barely a man. I'm gonna I'm gonna spend some time trying to uh trying to grow you up a little bit. I'm gonna go to some additional rooms just for you, my lad. Just for you. I feel you deserve the extra care and attention. Little old swindler. I mean, Swindler probably won't be able to provide too much here, but we'll give him the chance to uh, to be the best lad he can be. We shall give him the opportunity to prove himself. You can have all the pennies right now, my guy. If you'd have shown up earlier, we'd have been in the money right now. A little dead lung, nice. Nurse Goblin, okay. It was good stuff. What was that other trinket again? Okay, I don't even know. I think I think we lost it at some point. But Nurse Goblin, obviously very good. This was this was a worthy explore, regardless of if we get our little lad grown up or not.
Dude. I want to keep the Empress card. Fucking get out the way, you stupid pill. It's a tears of anyways. <laughs> oh, wait. Hematemesis. Eat, my boy. Eat. You're so close. You're so close to greatness. People have yet to see your true form. I, I need to stop getting hit. Giant Cell. Doesn't really do much. Come on. This last this last heart. Ah, oh, you bastard. You're so close, my lad. Why don't you just grow up one more time? I want to see what your final form looks like. Everyone does. And you got spider butt for me. Not exactly what we're looking for. Okay. Unfortunately, I think our fleshy boy isn't going to uh, to grow up big and strong like we hoped. Just going to grow a medium amount. Right, anyways. Let's get in here. See Wagwan. It's kind of funny how we just got a random card that produced... We got an active that gives you a random card that gave us a card that uses a random card. I ought to stop getting hit. You know? Probably would be a good shout. Ah, oh, you bastard. Dude, he just keeps doing the same attack over and over again. Well, that was pretty good. We're going again, are we? We're going again. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Are we going again? Nah, nah, not for a third time. Okay, that was pretty funny. <laughs> that was like the easiest second phase possible. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, come on. Flush kid, flush kid. You know you want to. Yes! Yes! <laughs> yes, we got him. That's so good. Oh. To end the run, he grows up into his full form. You've got to love it. Look, look at that little lad. Look at that cheeky little face. Oh my god. What an end to a run. Hope you guys did enjoy. This was a very fun run. And I'll see you guys in the next one.